Hey everybody, welcome back to the Dewitt Doodle Review. This week's subject, impossible houses. What? Impossible houses are my way of drawing inorganic things uh, to make it fun for me. I'm generally into drawing faces and monsters and that kind of thing, so drawing a house or a building or cars, not that fun. So I kind of abandon any sense of perspective or physics and I started drawing these houses. Much like my last video where I was drawing goofy faces, I don't draw using any kind of constructive method, which is how I do all of my other drawing. This is just grabbing a pencil and going at the page without a plan and seeing what happens. Uh, it's kind of the um, a hip hop equivalent of freestyling. I've only been doing these impossible houses for a couple of months. It's kind of a new idea of mine. And at this point, I feel like most of the houses look the same or the same kind of style of uh, fake architecture. But I've got grand ideas of where this could go. Uh, I know this is just the beginning of it and I just keep doing it uh, over and over and over. These things will develop into much weirder buildings than what I'm currently doing and uh, that's definitely my goal. I want to create some really really weird impossible houses. Besides wanting to improve the houses themselves, I also want to work on my shrubbery. At this point they're just little fluffy balls that I tuck into the corners around the houses and give them a sense of depth but um, being a gardener myself, those shrubberies are a little bit to be desired. So I'm going to work on that. I'm drawing once again with my trusty 6B pencil and also a 3B pencil. Um, I liked the 3B being able to give me a less soft line for some of the details of all the siding and things. I also hope that you've noticed I always leave one window open. Like every week, these drawings will be available for sale in my Etsy shop. Well, get your hands dirty, everybody. Make some drawings this week. We'll see you next week with the Do It Doodle Review. Do a review. Hey dog, cut it out. <laughs>